not Sven, it is Martin, yeah. Welcome to This Week in Sweden, where we look back at the seven news stories that shaped the life for us here in Sweden, starting with Monday. The body of a five-year-old girl who went missing on Saturday was found near a lake in central Sweden. Tuesday. A lot of beer, a lot of beer was spilled onto the road between Arboga and Urbu on the E18 uh, road uh, following a truck heading into the side of the road and then spilling a lot, a lot of beer. And they are now looking at whether any of it can be preserved or, you know, if it goes to waste. Wednesday. The Euro 2013 women's football tournament started here in Sweden on Wednesday and the second match of the night was Sweden, the hosting country against Denmark, which ended in a draw. Sweden then played Finland later in the week and won 5-0, now looking to advance to the next round. Thursday. A group of leading politicians and social elite has proposed that the Stockholm airport Arlanda should be renamed after Raud Wallenberg, who I mentioned in an earlier video. Raud Wallenberg saved tens of thousands of Jews during the Second World War. And following many other examples in the world like JFK and John Lennon International, they would suggest that it would rename the airport uh, after him. The airport is currently named after the area Arland, where it is situated, and the Swedish word for land which is lambda so all lambda Friday a video clip of a police woman beating a drunken man and sending a dog on him was released by a newspaper and this has opened question of whether this was legit or not prosecution has said this case needs to be open for investigation to find out clearly what happened before and after the videotape Saturday. A 29-year-old Swedish man died in Nazaré, Portugal after a failed base jumping. He jumped 100 meters and the parachute would not open. Sunday. Crown Princess Victoria celebrates her 36th birthday one week exactly to the day ahead of mine, which is July 21st. And as the tradition says, she is being celebrated on the island of Öland, where the royal family has a summer house, then followed by a concert later in the afternoon evening. And of course, her daughter, the little princess Estelle, stole the show because everybody wants to see her, nobody wants to see the queen to be. And that was another episode of This Week in Sweden. If you want to see more of these, you can check the playlist for the recent weeks. You can also check the playlist for my 10 Swedish words, which comes out every Thursday. This coming Thursday is a special one with a friend. So don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you the next time you click on one of my videos. She's your queen to be. And that was a reference. If you know the reference, let me know in the comments. And also let me know which of these seven news stories you found the most interesting. See you next time.